Hello, my loves. I hope everybody is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. So let's get started here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Um, we're going to start with some channeled messages, then we're going to do Oracle and get into your reading, okay? So Libra, what I picked up when I was meditating on you was kind of interesting. Um, I f oh gosh, I don't even know how to put this into words. There was such an overwhelming energy of, I can't wait to leave this mf -er, okay? I can't, like, someone here is planning an exit, okay? Someone here is planning an exit, um, and they just can't wait. Now, side note, okay, some of you might be waiting for someone to get out of prison, okay? Uh, but I feel ultimately that I don't know if it's a positive thing, you know, someone here just cannot wait to get out of a situation or to get unblocked or untied or like, I just can't wait to be like, you know, toodaloo, mother, you know what I'm saying? Like someone here is just like, there's this energy of, you know, yeah, you know, screw you, I'm out, you know, like that type of energy. Okay. So take that as it resonates, Libra. So let's see what we have here. Clarity, guidance. Love messages for my Libras, please. Step out of your comfort zone and luck is on your side. Okay, so Libra, I feel that, you know, whatever the situation is that you can't wait to get away from. Oh, that's funny. I'm sorry, they're dropping something off. So whatever the situation is that you can't wait to get rid of... To, words Libra whatever the situation that you can't wait to get away from it's going to bring you a lot of luck it's going to bring you a lot of fortune it may be uncomfortable because change is always uncomfortable but it's going to be amazing it's going to feel so good okay clarity guidance and love messages for my beautiful Aquarius oh, uh, see angel of strength and financial constraints okay libra you may have been holding back from leaving a situation because financially you couldn't afford to leave this person um or you may have been you know waiting to leave a job because you couldn't afford to leave the job but it's coming it's it's brewing inside of you because you can't stand being there anymore so whether this is a job or a relationship um i feel like you know you've been holding back because you don't want to lose finances money or whatever the case may be so it's a plan a, the plan of escape that's what this is the plan of escape tell me about libra please tell me about libra please spirit we've got taking steps and we've got the loving woman okay family friends and guides i feel like there may be a family or a friend here somebody that cares about you very much libra that you're going to be moving towards okay uh maybe you're planning on leaving a relationship and moving in with this person it could be a mom figure um it, it could even be for some of you a third party but i feel like someone here is moving towards a more loving energy and it's like i just can't wait to get out or get away from this person okay um, so let's go ahead and do these real quick. Spirit, tell me about Libra, please. Tell me about Libra. So he wants to come out. We've got butterfly. Relationship evolving to the next phase. Healing the inner child and growth and then abundance. Keep a positive mindset. Manifest exactly what you want. Gratitude and bliss. Um, I feel here, Libra, that you are growing. That you are healing. I feel like you're manifesting abundance into your life. And girl talk. Time with friends. Moving on. Happily single. Living in the moment. And having want fun. Libra, you can't wait to be someone. You can't wait to be free of something here. Someone cannot wait to be free. Tell me about Libra, please. Tell me about Libra. Yeah, you are done with this toxicity. Oh my gosh. You might have been dealing with a karmic soulmate, but you are done. You are so done with this toxicity. This could be a wedding that you're leaving behind uh, or, you know, a marriage that you're leaving behind. This can also be um, just a very strong connection. Somebody that you've been with a very long time. Somebody that you share, you know, finances with. Someone that you are very close to, okay? 
we've got the justice card is the first card out libra energy spirit tell me about libra please and the two of pentacles tell me about libra please the magician virgo gemini energy and the lover's card okay so libra i feel that you have been manifesting a beautiful love connection um like a strong soul tie connection eight of cups you're in a relationship right now where there is no love there's a lot of emotional disconnect the problem is is that with the justice card and the two of pentacles you're not sure if if you end this if it will be fair for you will you lose your home will you not you know what i'm saying it's like you don't know if this is going to end fairly or in your favor if you walk away from this connection tell me about the justice card here for libra they got the justice card again libra energy and the full card in the reverse this is what's stopping you from taking the risk this person may control the finances their name might be on everything you're being held back here um, because you're afraid that things will not turn in your favor tell me about the two of pentacles here yeah eight of swords in the reverse oh my gosh you cannot wait to free yourself here yeah, you're, you're just daydreaming. You're waiting, waiting, waiting about the day that you could just get in that car and zoom away. Okay, zoom away. You just want to get the heck out of there. Tell me about the magician and the eight of pentacles. You're working on it, though. You're working on manifesting this. Tell me about the lover's card, please. And the wheel of fortune you have manifested a beautiful connection here libra you've manifested a ten of pentacles a lover's card you've manifested something real and beautiful in your life and what the divine is doing is causing massive massive upheaval in your life to take out what doesn't serve and bring you what does look at this and the two of cups two of cups ten of pentacles and the lover's card you've got something amazing coming in the divine is just getting you ready okay Ooh, the divine is just getting you ready tell me about libra please what does libra need to know here please what does libra need to know here please spirit what does libra need to know here okay i'm getting that someone here is very emotionally manipulative we've got the king of cups cancer scorpio pisces energy we've got the page of pentacles you may have a child with this person but it doesn't have to be the nine of wands and we've got the five of swords i feel like someone here shows very little love and affection someone here maybe uh communicates very little they they treat you like you're just a friend um with the nine of wands this person is not emotionally available they're very defensive if you ask them a question and with the five of swords they play a shit ton of mind games mm -hmm. uh the emperor here and the wheel of fortune i feel like this is somebody that um it would appear that things always go in their favor it would appear that this person's always in control it would appear that this person is always like i said their name is on everything they're very dominant or whatever but i feel like the the tide is about to turn again the, the wheel is turning against this person okay and the tables are going to turn against this person tell me about this king of cups cancer scorpio pisces energy yes yeah, seven of swords in the reverse tell me about the page of pentacles um this is somebody that is going to try to prevent you from leaving two of cups and the ten of pentacles this is somebody that makes it where you're living very comfortable to the point where you're completely codependent and reliant on them do you see what i'm saying um this person may have gotten you pregnant to keep you in a relationship they want to keep you from leaving do you understand tell me about the nine of Gosh, I'm kind of get. I, this is gonna show how old I am. But have you ever heard that of that movie, Sleeping with the Enemy? That's kind of like the energy that I'm picking up on. Like someone here is just getting away from someone very abusive and toxic. With the Hermit here and the Knight of Pentacles, um, I feel like you have someone here that is always withdrawn, always working on something, always going somewhere. And if you dare to ask them what they're doing, they flip out on you. Tell me about the 
five of swords. Um, yeah, I feel like this person plays mind games because at the same time, they provide feelings of love. They provide feelings of stability. They provide these feelings um, that you're being taken care of, but it's not really the case when you look around, okay? Tell me about the challenge here for Libra. Tell me about the challenge here for Libra. <clears throat> Seven of Pentacles and the Devil card. Um, so the challenge here is that... Yeah, Four of Pentacles. You invested all your money into this person. You may have given this person all your money. Yeah, I, I feel like you gave this person all that you had. Like, for instance, let me give you an example. Let's just say when you met this person, you had your own apartment and, you know, you gave your apartment up and moved in with them. Now you don't have an apartment. Let's just say when you met this person, you had a vehicle, but they have three cars and they're like, what's the point of paying for that? Just get rid of your car and drive one of mine. Now you got no vehicle. You see what I'm saying? Um, let's just say you had your own checking account and this person's like, but why are we doing that? Just, you know, here, just put your money in my account. And do you understand what I'm saying? It's kind of like that energy because this person says and does things like that, Libra, to hold on to you so that you don't leave. Do you understand what I'm saying? And now you want to leave. You want to go. You're planning that escape, but you don't have anything. You don't have anything. So there's this energy of, you know what I'm saying? Um, there's this energy of trying to accumulate and working on the escape here. Okay, tell me about the outcome here. Tell me about the outcome here for Libra. We've got the Five of Pentacles. We've got the Knight of Wands, Leo, Sag, Aries energy. And then we've got the Page of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra energy. Yeah, I feel like you're just going to dip on this person, Libra. I feel like the day is going to come that you're just going to, out of nowhere, boom, done. You know what I'm saying? Um, you're just going to disappear on this person. You're already planning the escape. Maybe with, um, like I said, maybe going towards a mother figure or something. You're, you're already planning. It's already in the works is what I want to say. Okay, it's already in the works. Okay? All right, guys. I love you so much and take care. Bye, loves.